What's good, everybody? AC Boy Goofball Gaming back here with another video. And today, man, you know we do this every single year for every single promo, man. This is the ultimate freeze promo right here, man. Today, I am gonna be doing the sniping filter slash coin making method video, man. The video that every single one of my subscriber requests for, alright? But. Uh, before I start this video, man, make sure you guys go subscribe to my reaction channel, Step Back Reacts, link in the description, alright? But, without further ado, man, as you guys can see, I have 1,000 coins, so I'm freaking making bank right now, but I got a lot of stuff selling uh, right here, man, so just don't worry about that. Uh, but without further ado, man, let's get straight into it. So how are we going to want to make you know millions of coins a ton of coins for ultimate freeze man because there's a lot of uh, new stuff that dropped from ea man ea did a lot this promo as you guys can see let's let, you know what let's go into the sets right here let's go take a look at a little rundown i already did this in my last video but as you guys can see there's a lot of sets to get you know different stuff like elite ultimate freeze um present or elite ultimate freeze players um gold players right there uh you can get the freeze master which would, you can pick one, but I'm pretty sure that's untradeable. And then you can also get, you know, five golden players, all this stuff right here, man, all this good stuff right here. But, you know, it, it takes a lot to do, a lot of live events you have to grind for, but as long as, you know, they let you pick which collectibles you can get, you know, it should be kind of easier for you guys to complete these sets, all right? But, um, <clears throat> they also have the units, they have that every single promo now. Um, it, honestly, it, I'm not really happy with the packs, the sets are all right. Um, but you know the packs really aren't that good, but the sets you know what I'll take it. All right um, You also get any uh, defensive unit right there uh, for an elite present So there's a lot of stuff you can do right here elite player exchange all that stuff. All right, but uh, Today what are we gonna do? All right, we're gonna go over here um, Run the auction house and we're gonna use these sets for a way to let us make a ton of coins for ultimate freeze all right so we can see here we have five golden players right here um one of the best sets to do is actually this set now believe it or not this set will give you the highest chance to actually make coins if you're going to complete a set the only reason is there's two players that you really want from this i mean really three players from this elite ultimate freeze player uh pack you want uh brandon cooks who's 700,000 coins Dak prescott who's 550k and you want melvin gordon who's around 500k all right now each of these gold players go for around uh 20k so if you can get them for 20k man uh you can get uh, th uh those and if you pull one of them they all go for at least 500,000 coins but like brandon cooks he goes for a lot more because he's you know crazy fast and he's 91 overall but let's just go uh make sure let's go here brandon cooks 91 overall uh we're not going collectibles right here players and we want to go ultimate freeze items uh let's just go see how much he's worth so he is worth right here um He's worth 700,000 coins right here. Uh, oh, he's actually a 92 overall, which is kind of crazy. 92, you, let, me, let me look at his uh, stats real fast. 92 speed, 90 agility, 90 excel, 90 catch. If you put, if you train that player, man, oh my goodness, that's going to be a beast. All right. So we got Brandon Cuggs. We got Dak Prescott, uh, which I think is 91. Uh, yeah, he's 91. And he goes for around 650,000 coins. All right. So that's also good bank. You can also pick up Melvin Gordon right here, who I think is around 500 to 600 coins. Uh, I'm not really sure. I don't really snipe these players often, but this, it is an option right here. You can snipe these players. He goes for 580k, which is decent, man. Uh, good coins right there, man. So make sure you guys are doing that set. Uh, make sure, and if you guys are sniping all of these gold players right here, man. If you're sniping these gold, Jesus Christ. If you're sniping these gold ultimate freeze players, man, make sure you want to go 25,000 coins. All right, nothing more. Um, at, ooh, 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 come here, oh, Thierry. Oh, no. Geez. Oh, right. I don't have any coins. Right, I'm bankrupt. But look at that, man. They're pretty easy. And plus, when you complete the set, you'll have around 500k spent into it, which is the minimum you're going to make from that set already. And plus, you probably have some extra gold players that you have gotten from, you know, completing live events or opening packs. You probably have some extra ones. So, make sure you throw them in as well, which should um, lower it a bit. So, it should be around 400,000 coins you're buying from. So, you're almost guaranteed profit doing that set if you already have gold players just lying around. Alright, um, moving on, 
we're gonna go look at live events right here, man. Look at this, man. Look at these. Look at these gifts right here. Look at these little presents right here, bro. Um, sleep, cuh. They got all of these. They got silver presents this year and gold presents. This year. Gold presents this year, man. I'm not really amused with that, but hey, more presents means more gifts, right? Am I am I right or am I right? All right, so we're gonna have more things to look forward to when Chris when Christmas drops, man. So as you can see, this year everything a deadline is the same. You know, last year there was there were some that you know had deadlines at new year's maybe they'll release more presents i don't really know what's going on with ea right now they probably have something in store for us all right but looking at the presents you know this is a perfect opportunity to make coins because you can snipe a lot of these presents all right so looking at gold presents and silver presents not really anything that's that rare or that's out of the ordinary uh, to be honest on the on the auction house but there is a significant difference in um in um, uh, elite presents right here all right so we take a look at all these elite presents man one two three four five and six they're actually they're they're, they're not elite presents like there, there's no elite present six or there's no elite present one like it's just not a thing it's all in the gold present so ignore those numbers all right you don't want to use those numbers when you're sniping now when you get to 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, these are the ones you don't want to snipe, all right? Um, there are actually a couple of them that are extinct. I don't know. I'm not sure if it's uh, if you get to complete a set for them or if you if they're like in, they're particularly uh, not on the auction house. But if you take a look at elite collectibles, elite presents that are on the board, all right? You take a look at 15. It might just be my auction house, man. 15 is extinct. So if you actually get a 15, you should be um, celebrating. But I might be just being retarded right now and these might not be there all right 15 14 and 13 are all extinct on the auction house um but the best ones are 12 12 and 6 medium okay these are the best presents for some reason all right six because there's a ton of them for example if you look at seven right here all right let's take a look at seven so if we get a leave present seven we have a large and a medium now the large goes for 250k and the medium goes for 100k all right you could snipe this but you would have to separate it you would have to go from seven when the round drops you would have to go seven. Oh, oh, i need to go for the large ones now so you gotta go large present seven notice how slow that is notice just how like how slow it's just to filter out the medium so you really don't want to do that all right you really don't you really just kind of want to put seven and see if your luck is there man see if you because because you because you want to move on you don't want to just snipe seven all right you want to move on to seven eight nine ten eleven twelve you want to do everything in one round all right and by wasting your time to type in large present seven that kills time for all the other presents all right because there's also small present medium present and large present for eight all right um for uh number eight uh small present is i think yeah yeah small present is five uh 100k medium present is around 200k the large present and uh um the large present eight is actually 500,000 coins so make sure you guys want to snipe this one right here uh, number nine if you go look at uh, I think small present let's take a look at number nine right here number nine is a hundred K for small ones all the small ones are a hundred K except for number 12 man number 12 Jesus Christ medium right here is actually 400 K right here so if you go medium present nine see how long that takes me you guys do not want to do that you guys just want to kind of like just snipe it over all right 300k oh there's actually one for 264 right there that's pretty good profit i don't know why that isn't off the board yet someone should get that the good thing is you do get to filter it but the bad thing is it just takes a lot of time all right and then if you go large present nine it's extinct all right you guys can take my word for it. you guys can check on your own auction house it might be different i don't know all right number 10 let's take a look at this this it is all 100k oh 96k 93k there for uh, small present 10 i don't imagine this being anything good and then the medium present 10 is extinct like i said i don't know what ea is doing with the medium one it might be for new year's it might just not be in packs right now it might be that rare i don't know all right but medium 10 it's not it's non-existent all right if you look at 11 same thing 11 the small present is worth a hundred thousand coins but the medium present is still extinct like i said it might be for new year's i don't know now number 12 this is the special one right here number 12 look at this seven small present 12 of uh, 690k all right earlier i saw one that went for 290k all right so if you guys can stay on this number 12 i advise you guys to start on number 12 and work your way down 11 10 9 8 7 
like that, all right? I don't recommend starting at seven because that's the lowest chance you will make profit, all right? So start at number 12 when you're sniping. I know it's gonna be a, um, a lot of rounds where there's nothing, but once that one round comes in and you're the only one in the filter, when everyone has given up, then that's when you're gonna make a ton of coins and that's when you know that the, all that time that you took to wait for that one is worth it. All right, so number 12 and then the medium one is also extinct. Like I said, might be for New Year's, we never know. All right, but that's gonna be it for the, today's video, man. I will have another sniping filters video coming out after Christmas once they release the other gifts and once they release all the other stuff for New Year's. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, man. If you enjoyed, make sure you guys leave a like, make sure you guys subscribe if you guys are new. Without further ado, man, the goof is out. Peace.